Welcome ladies and gentlemen back to another Genshin Impact video. I was wondering if it was possible for a free to play player to actually get the battle pass level 50. In short, yes. But if you're interested in what you can miss during this time, stick around for some detailed information while we get into it. The battle pass itself exists out of 50 levels. Each level needs a thousand battle pass experience, so in total you need 50,000 battle pass experience. Quick maths. To obtain battle pass experience you can perform daily activities, weekly activities and battle pass length activities. The daily activities are fairly easy, you get experience for logging in, doing your 4 daily commission quests, mining 10 times and using 150 resin. The first 3 can be done in a matter of minutes, if you had to send characters on an expedition before you went to bed and then return with at least 10 ores, that activity is considered done. The only thing left is the resin. Try doing 1 or 2 leyline outcrops in the morning and then in the evening you can push out the full 120 resin on either bosses, domains and ley lines again. You'll be able to get 150 resin used up per day like this. Next to that you have 8 weekly quests, 2 of which make you gather 100 materials in Liyue and another 100 in Mondstadt. So by just exploring and gathering these can be easily obtained. You will need to spend half a million mora, that is even easier as I had done that in day 1 of the week by just leveling characters, ascending weapons and whatnot. You will also need to slay the two world bosses each week. You will do this automatically for the loot of course, so this is a given. Then the battle pass will ask you to do 20 ley lines, 15 domain challenges and 10 elite bosses. As you will do your dailies throughout the week, these will also be done naturally. Although fun fact, if you do spiral abyss, that counts as domain challenges as well. The only real bugger in this list is a 1600 resin uses. Let's do some calculations. You get 1 resin each 8 minutes. That's 10 resin in 80 minutes. So 120 resin each 960 minutes or 16 hours. One week consists of 168 hours, so you could get 10 and a half times 120 resin, which translates to 1260 resin. Even if you manage to min-max this, it's impossible to reach 1600 without spending primo gems to refresh some resin. You will need to refresh once every single day to get to 1600, which means you will need to sacrifice 350 primo gems each week. Though don't fret, I'll tell you in a minute why this is not necessary. For the battle pass activities, there are three to perform. One is to use a total of 5500 resin, which is absolutely manageable, not like the weekly. You will need to clear Spiral Abyss Floor 8, Chamber 3, and make a total of 50 wishes, which everyone and their mother has done by now. Though even as free to play, 50 wishes are doable every single battle pass. So with all that information, let's have a look at this chart. Daily, you will receive 645 battle pass experience. On a weekly basis, when you perform every single item, you will receive 5085 experience. And the battle pass activities will grant you a total of 6000 experience. The battle pass duration is 6 weeks, a total of 42 days. Which means 42 times 645 equals 27,090 experience. Good for 27 levels. By doing the weeklies, you get 6 times 5085 equals 30,510 experience. Good for 30 levels. Then adding the other 6,000 from the battle pass nets you 63,600 experience in grand total. Putting your battle pass at level 63 if you were able to pass level 50. What does this mean? If you were to skip the weekly 1600 resin uses, you can still grossly overextend the battle pass level. Since that will put the weekly experience on 4410, which translates to 26,460 experience in total and 59,550 overall. You could even miss a whole week of activities and you would still be able to get to level 50. So all of you free to play players are all set when you push your dailies every single day and keep an eye on the weeklies which you are missing. And don't even think of refreshing with primo gems. I hope this information helped you understand that being a free to play player will still make you reap all the passes benefits. Thank you for watching this video to completion you absolute legend. Leave a like, comment and subscribe so others can enjoy the content as well. This was Galaxy Brink Litchy, have a good one. Not break out the joy loom just yet. <laughs>